Hey there guys and welcome back to Prototype. In the last episode we went around and destroyed some machines pumping poison into the air so that Alex doesn't get killed. Also just buying some upgrades, uh, bought the consume boost because that's always handy. And now let's go and do the next mission. This one's kind of short so it's nice for a change. This disease is smart. When they hit it with blood tox, it went underground. It's been massing there, preparing to subsume the city. You need to make sure the blood tox pumper vehicle gets to Times Square. Then when the supplies of blood tox arrive, pump the stuff underground. Drive it out into the light. Without your help, that machine won't get within a mile of Times Square. Uh, wait. First we go around and make sure the blood tox stuff doesn't get spread. And now we're supposed to help it being spread around. That doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Also, why would the military let me help them? Or am I supposed to do it in disguise again? Figures. If they can pump enough of that toxin into the ground, then they might be able to flush out the infection, drive it to the street, and fight it. Yes, because they've been doing such an amazing job at that so far. Then again, I guess they do have the poison now, so they could stand a chance. Anyway, let's try this out. Target the commander. And get over here! Works like a charm. Okay, they did spot me, but... Oh, they're still spotting me. Ah, crap, it's a super soldier. Don't feel like dealing with you. Oh, he's remarkably weak for a super soldier. Oh well. And success. Deploy the blood tox pumper to Times Square. And how far exactly are we from Times Square? Because it's probably going to be one hell of a drive. Now obviously you can't use any of your powers for this because that would instantly give away that you're in the vicinity of the convoy and that'll only freak him out. So pretty much what you have to do is hop in a tank and protect it like that. And in that case I don't really see why Alex needs to help them because those guys are perfectly capable of driving their own tanks. So, when push comes to shove, this is yet another completely useless and unnecessary mission. But we'll do it anyway. Get another chance to drive around in a tank, run over infected civilians and blow up hunters. Except there are no hunters for some reason. Oh well, fine with me. Just rolling around, blowing up people with a tank, protecting that thing that for some reason doesn't even have weapons on it. Yeah, let's make a convoy vehicle and let's make sure that it can't defend itself without an escort. Genius idea! How stupid are these people? I mean, hell, if I'm figuring that stuff out, then it's really stupid because I'm not a particularly smart person. Although I might be short selling myself here. Um, okay, objective complete. But this ain't Times Square. I've never been there, but I know what it looks like. I mean, can't really miss it with all the giant TV screens and billboards and ads and all that stuff. It looks pretty neat. I kind of want to go there sometime. Yeah. Who knows, I might go to New York someday. It's a pretty popular Christmas destination from what I've heard. Hell, maybe I'll go there for Christmas sometime. And of course we get tentacles to deal with. Now they're not a particularly big threat if you're in a tank, like four shots of the main gun will kill them. And you can kind of just use yourself as a shield because they, all they pretty much do is throw crap and if you just maneuver yourself in the way the con the pumper vehicle won't get harmed unless it stands directly in my freaking line of fire yes that is a really smart move the AI in this game is so bad oh crap don't want to flip this thing over because I'm never gonna get it back up if it does and hijacking another tank will definitely bring suspicion on me so that would not be a very smart move on my end 
still, where are the hunters, though? I've gotten, like, two tentacles so far, and... Some of the really small infected civilians. That's basically it. Oh, crap, more tentacles. Only two of them, though, and there's, like, five tanks here with me, so... What do they really hope to accomplish? Not much. Oh, crap, the thing accidentally bounced and hit the... thing. Oh, well. Hydras are dead. Let's keep going. Maybe they just kind of hope to prevent the vehicle from going to Times Square by... littering the street with broken cars that it can't get over or something. Oh, well. Uh, where's the thing? Oh, there it is, just moving really slowly. Come on, we don't have all day. Oh, okay, we need to go this way. Why do I feel that they're taking me on a really big detour? Then again, I don't know the map in New York, don't know where exactly Times Square is. I do know that I think this is Central Park where we're at. Is Times Square close to Central Park? I believe it kind of is. I'm not entirely sure. Oh yeah, this is a really great road to be driving tanks on. Genius idea. Let's go drive through a park where there's trees that can be used as places for cover and all that stuff. What jackass is leading these military operations? He deserves to get sacked. Hell, he deserves to get the firing squad. <sighs> this is just... This doesn't work. Out of the way, convoy thing. Come on. Move, please. You can just run over these tiny guys. You don't need to shoot them. <sighs> oh, boy, oh boy. Are we nearly there yet? Uh, if I had a euro for every time I said that as a kid, I would be a very rich man right now. I'm pretty sure that's, that sentence is a major part of every kid's repertoire when they go on vacation or something. Or just even driving anywhere. Anyway, uh, stuff still blowing up. Still have no clue where we're going or if we're almost there yet. Ah, crap. Okay, that is a total of three Hydras. And I have no clue where the... Oh, there's the thing. Yeah, it doesn't really have the... You know. How about uh, you just stay back instead of driving all the way up to the front? Who the hell is driving that thing? What a bloody idiot. Alright, objective complete. Are we almost there yet? Come on, thing, hurry up. Come on. What the hell are you waiting for? Don't tell me we're turning around now. Okay, they're not. Just go. We're almost there, I hope. Come on, out of the way. Let me through. I'm the only one who actually knows what the hell he's doing, so I should be up front. Just blow up some guys. Always wonder, like, I don't think there'd be very much left of you if you're hit by, like, even a tank's machine gun. Because those have to be some pretty big-ass shells, that thing's shooting. It's only gonna leave you like a bloody pulp. Oh, yeah, I think we're almost there. I think that's Times Square right up ahead. Just gotta finish up a final Hydra, and then we should be all clear. Back scratch any overruns. Ah, crap. Well, I haven't seen any hunters yet, so I guess they don't send those after you this time around. Maybe they think the Hydras are already too difficult, whereas they are actually pretty damn easy if you're just in a tank. I'd hate having to do this segment just playing as Alex, though. Because Alex doesn't really fight those things particularly well. Come on, die. Okay, I think that's it. This is Times Square. All the enemies are dead. Objective complete. Not mission complete yet. Do we still have to do something? Here comes the thing. And now what? 
It's gonna load in like a boss fight? I don't think so, because we only have like 30 seconds left of the video. So there's the thing. And... Oh, okay, mission complete. I can live with that. So yeah, there we go. Short but sweet episode of Prototype. Next episode will be a good one. Because we get to see what the hell has been lurking underground until we started pumping in the poison. Anyway, I pick up a hint token and there's like a landmark collectible over there, so let's go and get that. There we go, go up here. It's another hint. And I couldn't even read what that said. Here's another landmark collectible. And that's all for now. So we'll, we'll just hop down and walk over to the mission thing. They don't have you walking halfway across the bloody city for once, so that's really generous of them. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Prototype. Thanks for watching.